Let's talk about your division. Your division's big. And when we talk your division's big, we're talking about the elite side as well. Yes. Now, look at the World Boxing Super Series. We've got Usyk versus Gassiev. Yeah. Big fight. A lot of people interested in that fight. How do you see that fight playing out? Um, I think that Usyk's um, pedigree and um, in-and-out movement is going to cause a lot of problems for Gassiev because he likes to attack guard um, and counter off people's shots on his guard. But I think where... Um, Ozek will be triggering, tapping, moving off to a side. So when Gaza throws, go to counter, he's counter. So I think stylistically, Ozek should have the advantage, especially where he had that fight with Bradis, where Bradis pushed him to the wire. So if he's, if it hasn't taken anything out of him and he's learnt from it, he'll be able to um, adapt well to Gaza's style. However, this is boxing, cruiserweight division. If Gaza have managed to catch him, anyone can be hurt, anything can happen. It seems like you're a student of the game. Do you watch a lot of boxing? Because not a lot of fighters watch a lot of boxing. Um, I, I, I watch, I watch a lot of boxing, but not. Um, I don't want to sit here and pretend that oh, my dad, I'm in the house or whatever time watching. But I watch fights relevant to the fight I'm about to have, and I like to watch fights for entertainment. So that's why I don't watch my Chamberlain fight back that much because I'm not. That, it's not that exciting. But I'd watch. Thomas Hearns, Evander Holyfield. So I like to watch fights to, um, to get me pumped to go and train. And when it's time to do my education, I do relevant education. So tall fighters knocking out smaller fighters or, you know, stuff like that.